Wow, like this is my face. Like, it's fucked up. Oh, it's a beautiful face, Sasa. Sasa, you know what day it is? It's day it's, to it's, fucking go to zero. And it's your day in the camera. Yeah. No. That's why we're filming me all the time. Like, it's fucked up. No, we are walking now to Starbucks. I think so, and we're gonna get something to eat because, or no, actually no. You know what are we doing right now? We're having a little walk, and then we are coming back. We ordered a uh, subway, so we're gonna come back to our practice room, eat, play a little bit, prepare, just chill, take our stuff, go to the studio, play the games, uh, go to zero, and go to the gym. Careful. <laughs> What are you doing, Salsa? Talking to the birds or what's going on? Uh, some good words. Your friends? Yes. All of them are scared. Yeah, well, on a weekend now, you know? I think they got scared of you. I will get them later. In my get cage. Them? Yes. Dinner? <laughs> no. It's like they're coming back to their homes. Okay. This is like now they're on holiday, you know? What you're seeing here is uh, Yacht warming up his uh, M249 skills, <laughs> MP9 skills also, <laughs> now he's MP5. One thing that players is worried about is their stats on HLTV, so like <laughs> he's warming up for the anti-egos right now actually. <laughs> When they have full clocks, he's gonna full send it with that bison. <laughs> <laughs> and the revolver. Like, we cannot forget the revolver, like... <laughs> I just won the last one, you know? Like, when you're playing alone, it's not difficult to win. Like, I've been winning three in a row when I play alone. Oh my god, man, you're so good. Three in a row? <laughs> Holy shit, man. You can say it. All right. Remove Mirage. Remove Mirage. And remove Vertigo. And remove Vertigo. Uh, then you. 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 We are playing Ancient against our friends from OG. It's their best map, it's our best map. Let's see what happens. Playground. Yeah, let's hope so. Listen, uh, we have some things we have some things on the paper obviously that we're gonna when we take headsets on, we're just gonna quickly recap some of the stuff. We're just gonna mention some do's and don'ts and some good things and what we went through in the game plan, that's it. Other than that, in these types of events, read and adjust. That's it. Read and adjust. Have fun with the game. Let's just fucking be hype as fuck, right? Mm -hmm. Like, forget the fucking papers. If we need to throw them out and throw them in the bin, we throw them in the bin. We play the, we play the rounds, we read our opponents, and then we do what the fuck is right, right? Yeah. Now, this is what we have been practicing for already, this identity. Now, you go onto that server, and you show that identity and everything that we have been working on. It might not be there 100% yet, but everything that we have been working on is that over the last especially the last 14 days, I am so proud of how this team has been coming together. Like, as one unit, as one group. Now we go on all the way, one perfect round at a time and show it. Mm -hmm. Alright guys, yeah, let's have some fun. Let's let's one, two, three! Hey!
Apex. Ooh, some ancient indeed. Apex currently on a four map winning streak on this very map into the donut area. Oh, we'll trade hands. Also takes a bunch of damage in towards the site. Ten seconds though. He can deny the plant. That's the difference maker. But this fan gives his air. And there will be not enough time for the defuse. Oh, she actually have a 3v2 advantage. Stiko takes the bullet though and puts it into the head of Keto. And it's going to be a round to Apex. Comes through on the cave side. Heavy guard is there on the off angle. Still takes him. Taps the bomb. There's not much time left here. Regardless, he's going to show his no! hand. And he gets taken down by Stiko. No! It's going to be close, but it should be the full defuse. Headset is off. Stiko, full confidence. No, yes, Win the 13 5. Well done. Great game. Well done. Right, we just beat OG 13 to 5 in the first game in Bucharest, and you were farming Jacob. How are you feeling after the game? I'm feeling good, of course. I mean, it was expected to win, uh, especially when we saw the map. And I know that Ancient is my best map, so I don't know. Really good going, like really confident going into it, especially with the map with the opponent. So you know, kind of expected. And now we're playing the one zero game later today, uh, probably against Cloud9. How are you looking at that matchup? Cloud9 is a much, much harder uh, matchup, of course. And a team I would say that we have been struggling with in the past. Not that we have met them so many times, but you know, practice wise, their style of play, you know, it's not really the greatest matchup for us. But you know, I think there was tougher teams that we could have gotten Vitality, Spirit. So I'm, I think Cloud9 is like a, it's a good matchup in one way, but it can also be tough, of course. Uh, what did it mean to like get the first win like instantly here in Bucharest? Like, do it like help with the nerves or how do you feel? Yeah, I mean, <clears throat> winning the first game, like nothing is like nothing is decided after winning or losing the first game. But of course, it takes some pressure off our shoulders because you know, zero one game, lose that one, zero two, that is a that is a tough way to come back. You can still go three one, you know, win tomorrow even if you lose tonight. So it's a good feeling. Right. Good luck. Thank you. Okay, so we are playing right now. It's scheduled to seven, right? Yes. Scheduling wise, that means you have at least an hour to uh, relax and be uh, calm down or whatever you guys need. And then uh, you just need to be ready for um, meeting up at five. Whether that be here real quick or uh, in the lobby, we don't know exactly, but something in those, those lines, right? Me and Elliot is looking into the uh, Cloud9 game now. So whatever you need, if that is to rest, sleep, take a shower, get food, go to the room. How many tomatoes can you put in this multi? <laughs> tomatoes are so good. Huh? Tomato good? Yes. That's what I'm asking. If we subbed him in to plug the cables and sub him out again. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. If you first that's what I'm asking. Can it like relax? <laughs> I don't know if you'd like to. No. I, what do you need to do? Connect the cables. He did say if you plugged it in, you go buy all the nades. You know, I don't think I'll spend anyway because I wouldn't hit them. Thanks. They're failing all the time. <laughs> <laughs> all the time. So bad. So bad with nades. Oh, 
No. Hi, hi. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> so we would like to be team B. That means the uh, we. You, you that means we pick the map, right? Yeah, yeah. And they pick the side. Yep. Okay, yeah. Two packs, first two guns. We are removing nuke. Remove nuke. And we will remove Anubis. Remove Anubis. Yes. Vertigo. Remove Vertigo. Ancient. Ancient. We ban Inferno. Ban Inferno. Uh, play Mirage. So, play Mirage. ban over pass. Yeah, yeah. Uh, okay, Mirage. where's CT? CT. Okay, good luck. Good luck. Okay. Thank Boys, in that, uh, in that first game we played today, so nice with the comps, the activity that you're reading it already in the second round when Tim is saying, guys, they have anti us. And we just like, we read and we adjust from there. Same thing goes now, right? Let's play on our terms with what we have practiced. Like there's not kind of not a map right now that we haven't had like some kind of a small crisis on, but every time that we have met those kind of challenges, we fixed it. Time to prove this Mirage is back. Right? Yeah. Let's fucking go. All Let's the way, it. boys. Right? One, two, three. Hey, everybody yeah. so this is Cloud9 versus Apex. Over. Here's the retake. Flashbang is out. They got to get kills quick. That's a great start. All hail Boomich. He gets traded off, but there's still Glocks up in their face. Oh, yes. That's Glocks in the face, in the mouth. No pulling this one back for Hobbit. Sassany Smoke sees the play across into default. Molotov's gonna force two Cloud9 players into the open and burn them both away. I think any time to rotate. Oh. oh, there goes the off as well. No scope doesn't land. That's just a sick call from Apex. Or if he just stays at this ramp, he's gonna start falling back. This might be perfect timing. Perfect timing. Sense senses it. Oh, and a kill comes in again from Sticko on a Hobbit. The only way he wins this. And Burmich has oh. stopped through the default box. An awkward fight, and another kill for Knock on the Deagle. Nice. Stiko overrun at the bench. B9 health immediately off the back of that. They're, they're quick. Yeah, they're moving up cap very, very fast. They seem to have sensed a weakness, but Stiko and Satsunito put a stop to it, and now Knock chimes in with the AWP. Well, faster rounds not working out for Cloud9. Seconds, this can still be chaotic. Hobbit kills Jake Kim at CT. Bomb plant is coming oh, through, and Boomich will get it through. Sprints to the bomb site. Oh, he's gonna stick it, but it's denial. Hobbit comes around the back, and Cloud9 today will go two and zero on their best of one record. One best of three win away from qualifying for the major in Copenhagen. What a recovery from the first half. Cloud9, a completely different team, and Hobbit giving some props over to Big Boomage because that was a fantastically cold T side. All right, Sassanito just lost 10-13 against Cloud9 after a ref CT side. Tell me a bit about what happened. Uh, we had a really good T side. It was working the stuff we prepared and played against them. Uh, we lost some uh, half buys and could have been better a bit on T side. We lost the pistol round in CT. There were like one or two rounds that uh, end the game. like. They had uh, lucky kills like the round on 10-11 where we had 4v2 and we, we lost it somehow, but yeah, it was it was a close game. After the first day we're 1-1 and playing the next game tomorrow, um, how are you looking at your chances to go 2-1 tomorrow? I think we are playing uh, really good right now. Uh, like there's a slight uh, uh, small rounds that are costing us the game. And I think if we continue like this and we play tomorrow like this, we, we're going to qualify. And what will you do the rest of the day, like before you go to bed? You will prepare for tomorrow and look at the games? I think we're going to have a talk uh, in the break room, uh, what happened today and what we can improve for tomorrow. Chill a bit, of course. It was a rough day. So after that, we're going to go to bed and rest for tomorrow. Hey guys, we are back at the hotel. Uh, we had our dinner together as a team and uh, we went uh, in the prac room to prepare for tomorrow's game against Monte. So tomorrow at uh, 1 p.m. or 12 p.m. your local time, we are playing against Monte. Thank you so much for our support. We'll, we will need you tomorrow, so let's go. We need to get this 2-1. Remember to like, subscribe, share and do whatever you need. Let's go.
time to sleep.